I've got a, a two-part question for you here, and uh, they're both about Mark Hoppus, formerly of Blink-182 and Plus44. Do you like him? And have you had any contact with him this year? I don't know their music, and I haven't had any contact with them. Can I play a little video for you? Sure. How, how are we going to watch a video? Check it's the iPod, man. Oh, okay. If you were to choose a female today to add to the band as a, as a vocalist, who would you pick? you got the world to choose from. Um, Emily Haynes from Metric, yeah, I think she's badass. I love her voice and I think she's really creative and I think that she writes great lyrics and has cool songs. She does side projects. Yeah, I know. It'd be cool. That's nice. It was not, it... I think they sent me something actually, now that I think about it. For that new project, I think they sent me something and I unfortunately couldn't participate because I was too, I was working in, with Metric obviously, it's like my yeah. life, so that's nice. Thanks for letting us know that. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank One you. One thing that I've always kind of dug about your band is the music community that you've got. I mean, everyone knows, you know, a lot of the characters. How important is that to you to have that community of, of friends, both personally and professionally? It's amazing. It's like what, it's a lot of the reason why we do this, you know, and, and continue to do it and lead a, a sort of a fulfilling life at the same time, you know. It's like you can be on the road forever. You can hit all these stages. You can play in front of millions of people and if you don't have that other thing to balance out your life it can get really hollow and empty and uh, I don't know, for me personally I'm so thankful that I have an amazing community of friends at home who are all great musicians and I get to play with and travel with and do great things with. It feels like it was a decision to whether it was conscious or not but it's something when we were all starting out it was like that's what unified us was this principle of like we're all going to be doing our thing right next to each other so we can either be really competitive and enemies or we can create a community and the fact that we chose the latter it's like there's still healthy competition and there should be it's like when I you know I hear like frightening lives on Kevin Drew's solo records spirit if like that song to me I'm like damn it I wish I wrote that you know and it makes me yeah. want to be want to be good and I know that he has moments with with metric it goes all the way around with all of us that we that you, you stay inspired to like do it really well and, and put your whole self into it when your friends do that too you know so but yeah I could go on about that because with, <laughs> without that I agree with you it's like I don't I don't have it in me Jules already said me this I don't have it in me to be the like I'm gonna get there like I gotta go I don't really need to go anywhere. I just want to be with my friends and get to keep doing it. You know? Yeah, I'd always want to get, I'd rather get somewhere in the middle with everyone I love than to get to the top of my own. Life is good. Nice. Well, you probably are going to be somewhere in the middle. <laughs> it it's, looks it's, like it's look nice. where that's, we are that's right where now. The, that's where the crowd is. It's that's good times. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much. Good luck Pleasure. with the new record. Can't wait to hear it. Thanks. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? What's up? Are you ready for it? <laughs> We're from Anti Flag. Corn. I'm Chris Cornell. Blue October. From Buck Cherry. Howie D of the Backstreet Boys. Everclear. We're Sparta. Fallout Boy. And you are watching the Adler Cast. Adler Cast. The Adler Cast. The Adler Cast. Adler Cast. Adler Cast. And you are watching the Adler Cast. Peace out. <laughs>